what's happening? Just want to come on here and uh, give you a little chainsaw tip for the day. Uh, so I was using this thing. Uh, it's a, just a little Poulan Pro. It's nothing crazy. It's not a still or steel or however you're supposed to pronounce it or uh, John Deere or any of that. It's just a chainsaw. So I was cutting into some wood and cutting into the log I found that the bar was trying to do this and it was always binding and it was just going like that so one little tip for that means um, if you if you take the bar itself and each side of the bar comes up and then it's flat on top and there's a groove where your chain sits in a lot of times that top that top edge is worn down on one side or the other which makes your chain sit like that so on the bottom or the top uh, usually on the bottom sorry uh, but I'm just showing you on the top so you understand what I'm talking about so what happens is it wears unevenly and that's what causes that so two things you can do you can flip your bar of your chainsaw over is uh, the top usually doesn't wear like the bottom does because you're always cutting on that bottom edge so that's what I'm going to try right now and if that doesn't work then you have to uh, either file it there's a, there's a little tool you can get that makes a complete 90 degree, uh, uh, makes it easier to file it right at 90 degrees. Or you can, if you have a shop, you're available, uh, like some sort of um, mold shop or uh, any kind of a 90 degree sander would work or anything like that. But uh, I'll probably take it off and take it to the shop and uh, do that anyways and just file it 90 degrees, uh, lay the bar flat on a bench and um, either use a sander or a, a file or something, but that's what's going on. So uh, that was just a little tip, but I know a lot of people have problems with their chainsaws and uh, I'm going to do that now for you. So now that we got the bar off, uh, I'm going to try and show you in the camera. I'm going to flip it over, we're going to look at that bottom, right on that bottom edge and I can tell by looking at it with the naked eye that it's it's uneven um, if we flip it over the top is is pretty even so I'm gonna I'm you just just flip it put the bottom on the top top on the bottom put it back together um, and that should that should work for you now you you can either try to file them back 90 degrees like this to the side or you buy a new bar but that's that's what's going on. Your your chain is sitting crooked, and that's why it's cutting and binding like that. So I hope that helps. Uh, a little tip of the day.